This is the day that the stay-at-home order is supposed to take effect in Alabama. And everyone is at the Walmart. They have set up this lovely cattle corral and have people waiting in line to get in because they are actually limiting the number of people allowed in the store, which quite honestly amazes me. This is Walmart after all. The bakery is still fairly well supplied. And I'm amazed to see that there's still bread on the shelves. The produce department is still fairly well stocked. And yes, I came in here basically to do just this. I was curious. Okay, if you are looking for ground beef, you're completely out of luck. But you want some expensive steaks, and they got you covered. Still got a nice selection of sausages, but you can forget pork roast or pork chops. You're pretty much out of luck there. Yeah, they are. <laughs> And they still have some boneless, skinless chicken breasts, but yeah. Otherwise, you're kind of out of luck there, too. Ooh, you want bacon? They got bacon. Yes, they do. And they still have hot dogs as well. Wow, I'm amazed. Ooh, and luncheon meat. I honestly expected these things to be completely gone by this morning. And of course, since they're $1.50 a piece, they've got plenty of Lunchables because no one wants them. Ooh, and of course, as is normal these days, no toilet paper. And no paper towels either. Ooh, I'm wrong. They got their little generic. Wow. Let's go check out their bottled water and milk. They have the gallon jugs of the great value water. And they're unpacking some bottled water. So I guess they still have some of that. <laughs> That's what I get for buying Dollar Tree sunglasses. <laughs> did I just see you outside? Yes, you did. Okay. <laughs> You're not going crazy. I was, um, okay. So, they still have eggs in stock as well. I'm amazed and a good selection of milk. If you need it, I suggest you come get it.